Hold your breath. Most women who are screened for breast cancer will never go on to become a patient. You're doing great, hang in there. But for those who do, the Baptist Breast Center in San Antonio is offering a new model of care, an innovative approach to help women through one of the scariest experiences they will ever face. Excellent. It can be an anxiety provoking time, so being able to bring this level of care to somebody's own backyard uh, increases the efficiency and the delivery of care. The idea is to provide screening, genetic counseling, diagnosis, navigation, treatment, and survivor support all in the same location. The Baptist Breast Center has been accredited by the NAPBC, the National Accreditation Program for Breast Centers, a much sought after designation granted to only a handful of programs in Texas and a few dozen around the nation. That's what we're achieving within the Breast Center and the Breast Center Network. It really represents a dramatic change in the way that breast care is delivered in San Antonio and South Texas. Women diagnosed with breast cancer can so, rely on a participating physician network for coordination of care, providing immediate access to specialists, from surgeons to medical, radiation, and surgical oncologists to plastic surgeons. It's the way that the entire group comes together. Um, two heads are better than one. Well, 15 heads are better than one. How we work together is just is a new concept for San Antonio. An important part of the team, certified genetic counselors who provide women with testing for themselves and their family members, taking some of the guesswork out of assessing risk. Specially trained certified breast care nurse navigators act as guides for patients and their families, helping women with all aspects of their complicated care. They aid women in setting up appointments, dealing with insurance, coping with side effects, and most of all, they let them know step by step what needs to take place to facilitate healing. When the Baptist Breast Center celebrated its one-year anniversary at North Central Baptist Hospital, clinicians and patients celebrated the wonderful stories of survival made possible by excellent care. Director Dr. Morton Kallenberg says the Baptist Breast Center's approach to care takes much of the uncertainty out of a frightening diagnosis. So the real driver was changing a traditional model, one that was less than ideal, to an efficient model where you could eliminate the wait, eliminate the unknown. The success of the North Central location has sparked an expansion. The Baptist Breast Network is spreading to all areas of the city, making access easier for women across San Antonio. Women can also access the Baptist Breast Network downtown next to Baptist Medical Center, at Mission Trail Baptist on the south side, and in Westover Hills. By having the people and the technology all together, the Baptist Breast Center can decrease the time from breast cancer diagnosis to treatment, giving women innovative care in a healing environment. And hold your breath. Breast imaging has taken a huge leap forward with the introduction of tomosynthesis, 3D mammography that takes images in slices that the computer reconstructs into a detailed picture doctors scroll through to pinpoint problems. Baptist was the first to bring this incredible advance to San Antonio patients. Instead of two views, you got 53 views. Advanced technology and clinical expertise help create a seamless network of care for patients, putting the Baptist Breast Network on par with the finest breast centers in the country. The referring physicians don't really have to worry that that patient is going to fall through the cracks because we have a lot of checks and balances to be sure that the patient is well taken care of and they have everything that they need in one stop. Innovative breast cancer care in a healing environment. That's the difference. That's Baptist Care. For more information, log on to BaptistBreastCenter.com or call 297-7005. For the Baptist Health News Network, I'm Wendy Rigby.